Hello, today I want to talk about the capital asset pricing model or CAP M again. Now you can see my previous uh, discussions on this topic if you follow any of these links here. Today I want to talk about the underlying assumptions and question whether or not they are close to reality. If they are in fact realistic, let's go through these assumptions quickly. Uh, every investor out there only wants to maximize their economic utility. They don't care about anything else. There's no emotions involved. Uh, there's no good feelings involved. There's no, hey, I like this stock or whatever. It's all about maximizing this utility. Uh, all investors are irrational and risk inverse. Uh, specifically, they are mean variance optimizers. That's how they're doing this, both in terms of their utility maximization and their rational thinking. Uh, all investors are diversified. So that means there aren't any invest investors out there that have a portfolio with a small number of assets. They're all perfectly well diversified. Uh, all investors, regardless of their size, are price takers. That means that no matter how much they want to trade, they cannot move the markets. It's the price and that's it. Um, fine, you can borrow and lend at infinite volume uh, at the risk-free rate. Uh, not only that, but uh, all investment horizons are single period. The risk-free rate does not change during that period. Uh, all transaction costs, all taxes, they're not there, okay? There's no frictions whatsoever. Any kind of trading you need to do is free to all investors. Uh, all assets are infinitely divisible. They're all perfectly liquid. If you want to buy one penny of whatever asset, you can do that. All assets, this is, you know, alternative investments, you know, super liquid public investments. They're all this way. Um, all investors have homogeneous expectations. What this means is that every single investor has the exact same view on every single asset out there. Okay. Um, and finally, all the information out there for every single asset is instantaneously known by every single uh, investor and they all act on it simultaneously, all right? So the question for you, of course, is are you serious? Like basically none of these uh, assumptions are realistic or reflect reality. Uh, I do hope to have another follow-up video uh, on the cap end because I think there's some other things we need to think about. I uh, hope you enjoyed that today. Thank you so much for listening. I'm Brian Kozlowski.